Hello friends, welcome back another video by Sensorus YouTube channel. So friends, how are you? I hope you all are fine and doing well. So for today's science topic is coal and petroleum. For this is for class six, seven, and eight science topic. So if you are not subscribed to our channel, then please hit the subscribe button and also press the bell icon so you never miss any video. So let's start the video. Okay. So what is coal? So coal is one of a fuel which used to cook food earlier. It was used in railway engines to produce steam to run the engine or to produce the steam run the engine. So basically coil is product which is used to cook food earlier and also used in steam engine to run a train. So after that story of a coal is very interesting story. So about 300 million years ago, the earth had dense forest in low whitling wet areas due to the natural process like flooding. This forest get buried under soil. As more soil deposited over them, they were compressed. The temperature also rose as they sank deeper and deeper under high pressure and high temperature. Dead plants go slowly converted to coal as coal contain many carbon. The slowly process of convenience of coal vegetation into coal is called carbonization. So about 300 million years ago on earth when human is not created. Uh, dense forest means natural disaster are coming like flooding. Due to this flooding, uh, forests get buried under soil and due to the flooding comes many times this means this forest get buried uh, deeper and deeper in soil and then it convert into coal. So this process is known as carbonization. So after this coil, the coil is a process into industry to make a useful thing. The useful thing is like coke, coal tar and coal gas. So these three. So let us understand them in detail so what is coke tar coil tar and coil gas so first what is coke so basically it is a tough porous and black substance it is almost pure form of carbon coke is used in manufacture of steel and in extraction of many metals so basically coke is substance or a product which is very black and very porous and tough means it's very hard and very porous means it can get be easily cracked if it can be harmed and it, in, it is an almost made up of pure form of carbon and this is used in manufacture of steel and also in extraction of many metals. So after that what is coal tar? So basically it is a black thick liquid which is an unpleasant smell. It is a mixture of about 200 substance product obtained from coal tar and used for material for manufacturing various substance which used in everyday life and industry like synthetic drug, explosion etc photographic material. So basically interestingly, uh, balls means happen thinly ball are used to repel moths and other insect are also obtained from coal tar. So coal tar is a black substance or black liquid which has an unpleasant smell and it is a mixture of about 200 substance or a product. Third, what is coal gas? Coal gas is obtained during the process of coal to get cooked. It is used as fuel in many industries situated near a coal gas processing plant. Coal gas was used for street lighting for first time in London in 1810 and in Europe around 1820. Nowadays it is used source for heat rather than the light. So basically coal gas it is a substance in which it used for street light in London in 18th and nowadays it is used for heat rather than light. After this what is petroleum? as you know all petroleum so petroleum it is a heavy motor vehicle like trucks and tractor they run on diesel petrol and diesel are obtained from natural resource called petroleum the word petroleum is derived from petra rock and oleum oil as it is mined from between rock under earth so basically petroleum means you are using a vehicle like uh, means a heavy motor vehicle like trucks and tractors these are run on diesel and petrols our car are uh, run on petrol so these petrol and diesel are obtained from a substance this substance is known as petroleum so why this substance name is petroleum Be because a petroleum is, is derived from word petra Petra means rock and oleum means oil and it is mined because it is found between the rock and the earth so that was its name is petroleum and in this derived from petra and oleum. After that how is this petrol formed? So as I tell the petroleum was formed from living organism living in the sea. As this organism died, their body settled at bottom of the sea and get covered with layer of sand and clay. Over millions of years, absence of air, high temperature and high pressure, they transfer the dead organism into petroleum and natural gas. So this petroleum is formed means when uh, aquatic animals which died in a sea 
these bodies get settled under a high pressure at a bottom of a sea due to this high temperature and high pressure the high pressure the water transferred the dead organism into a petroleum and also a natural gas so our petrol are petrol and diesel are obtained from petroleum so just see how petroleum is formed in a sea so after that what is petroleum refinery refinery means where a petrol stored so petroleum is dark and oily liquid as all we have seen it is an unpleasant odor it means it is very unpleasant smell and it is mixture of consequences such as petroleum gas petrol diesel lubricating oil paraffin wax etc paraffin wax means a candle is made up of paraffin wax the process of separating the various constituent fraction of petroleum is known as refining it is carried out in petroleum refinery refinery means a process in which a petroleum are divided means when a petrol and diesel are obtained from petroleum so there are so many other gases means other mixture like diesel lubricating oil paraffin wax these uh, these all of these things are separated and this process of separating is known as refinery and these are stored in refinery object and it is carried out in petroleum refinery so after that natural gas as you know a uh, petroleum is obtained from natural gas lubricating so what is this natural gas so just i tell a whole means not reading whole paragraph i just tell a summary of a whole paragraph so natural gas it is a very important fossil fuels because it is uh, easy to transfer through pipe natural gas it is a form of gaseous which is stored under high pressure in cng cng full form is compressed natural gas cng is used in power generation or or nowadays our vehicles are come in cng because it produce very less amount of air pollution and also a uh, advantage of cng is that it can use be directly for burning in a uh, homes factories and cng is uh, used for a uh, vehicle because uh, less polluting and it's a uh, cleaner than the great advantage of cng is directly for burning homes factories where it can be used supplied through pipes natural gas is also used in starting material for the manufacturing of number of chemical fertilization so as natural gas is also used in fertilization means sorry uh, making production of chemical and fertilizers so it's last topic the how to save natural gases because it's in gaseous form so it's very difficult to save so it's required that organism millions of year to get converted into these fuels so in india petroleum conversion reach association pcra advises people how to save petrol and diesel so first point is drive at constant and moderate speed as far as possible second switch off the engine at traffic light at place where you have to wait third ensures correct tire pressures it ensures means a pcra basically it is one company or institute you can say which tell us people that how to save our natural gases so first it, they say that drive at constant speed means if you means if you drive vehicle very fast then a uh, natural gas is also used very rapidly means for example petrol used very rapidly in vehicle and if you drive at moderate speed as far as possible then it can could be saved second to as if there is traffic so you can switch off your vehicles at engine of switch of uh, engine of uh, vehicle at traffic light and third to ensure a correct tire pressure means sometime we what we happens we our tire have no pressure or the, and then that why our car is taking so much of petroleum so ensure a correct tire of pressure so over here your whole chapter is completed so thank you for watching this video if you like please like this video share with your friend and if you have any doubt please ask in comment i will give answer to you subscribe to our channel and my special thing is coming to uh, this channel so stay tuned thank you stay home stay safe thank you guys